Hello Minecraft fans, Dave Chaos here, and welcome to another mod spotlight of mine, and today we're going to be looking at Trapcraft. Now this adds a few little um, items into the mod which you can use for basically trapping and killing other mobs. So I'm going to start with, um, first, the dummy. And all you need for the dummy is a head, <laughs> a Steve head, which you can craft, I'll show you the crafting recipes soon. And uh, two blocks of wood, so you put your two blocks of wood down like this, and a Steve head on top. Bing! And there you go, you've got yourself a Steve. Uh, he, d he doesn't move, he just stands there, like that. Um, he's got 20 hearts of health, and uh, all mobs will be aggroed by him. So let's spawn a creeper over here, and there you go, creeper's going straight for him. Boom! So they're there quite handy if you had a house and uh, you want to have a few dummies hanging around. Go away sheep, just go away. So let's put another one down and see how he goes for him first. Oh, poor Steve, he's dead now. He should, if he didn't get blown up, there he is. His head gets dropped, so you can just go and pick that back up again. Right, so that's the dummies out of the way. Let's get rid of that. And we can switch that off now. Um, let's move on to the next trap. Whoops. Which is called the igniter. So I've set some up in the floor here. Um, again, I'll show you the recipes for all this later. And uh, I've just stuck some pressure plates to it next to it. So you can have these pretty much anywhere you like. Wire them up with a bit of redstone. And when you stand on the pressure plate, there you go, you get a flame out of it. You don't need to put any fuel in or anything like that. They just work, which is kind of handy. So there we go. Very good, very nice, I like them. Got a lovely little trap there. The next one is in here. But you can't see it. That's the idea, you can't see it. So, let's get ourselves... Uh, I've put a spawner, a bunch of pig spawners in here. Let's get a couple. Hey piggies, and uh, let's get them to follow me. Come on, come down here. <laughs> ah, look, oh no! <laughs> So as you can see, there is, uh, I've, I've dug a hole in the floor, and we've put spikes in it, and uh, we've got the grass. Now all the sticks are coming from the grass, because uh, the recipe is sticks and grass, so again I'll show you in a moment. And I'll show you the recipe for the spikes as well. So that's a nice little one. Good for uh, unsuspecting victims, you could have one of them in, at your front door or something like that if you liked. Okay, the next one we're going to check out is this. This is the uh, fan block, so this will blow mobs. And uh, what we're going to do is set it to night so we can uh, spawn ourselves a zombie. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to switch these on. You can again wire them up with redstone in any way you like. And we're going to get oh, hang on, we're going to need uh, let's see now. Let's get some grass, and let's get some grass covers. And what I'm going to do is I'll put them across there like that, and I will then... What the hell is pushing me? Oh, silly me. Put them like that. You see, see those in action. I can't fill the middle in, unfortunately. Right, so what we're going to do is we're going to spawn a zombie over there, and he should come for me. Hey, Mr. Zombie! Hey! Hey! Oh! Bloody hell, he's got caught by that. Okay, let's... Oh, bloody hell, I keep forgetting. I'm terrible at this. There we go. Hey, Mr. Zombie! Here he comes, here he comes. Get him to come across here, and he should get blown, he does! Ooh! Back off! Oh crap! <laughs> right. So, go away. Go on a day to chase me over here. Oh god, he can as well. Get out! Get off! Come get me down here then, this spider. Come on! Ooh, he's, he's eager, isn't he? Eager. Well, he can't get me now because the fans are blowing him. Haha. Uh -huh. Anyway, as you can see, if um, anything gets in front of the fan, they just get pushed away. Like that, and the spider can't get me now, which is nice. So the fans can be good. 
for blowing people into traps. Right, let's get the sun back up now. <laughs> uh, the other one, as you can see, is, is this. Let's see, reset that. Which is the bear traps. So this is two bear traps next to each other. And what I've done is I've set a load so that I can... Let's make it night time again. And we'll... We will get some zombies to chase us. Oh god. Huh. Now the good thing about the traps is you can stand on them and you won't set them off. But mobs will. So let's get that zombie to chase me. And there we go, they've all been trapped. And they'll periodic periodically be damaged until eventually they'll die. There you go, that's pretty sweet. So that is... Oh, there's one more. One more, one more, one more. Let's um, get away from all that noise. Make it day again. Is this one. This is called a magnetic chest. And it behaves just like a normal chest with uh, being able to store items. You can drop items near it and it'll get sucked in. Like so. So, as you can see, diamonds. Now, it works for two block radius, so you need to be two blocks close. So, you can just chuck them all on the floor there, like, like this. And as you can see, some of them didn't quite make it. There we go. And they should all be in there. There we go. How cool is that? So that's the magnetic chest. So you could set up yourself a nice little farming trap. Put a couple of magnetic chests next to, say, the death point. So for example, if you had um, a pit like this with the fans next to it, and you had a magnetic chest next to it, it would just suck in all of the uh, items that the mobs fall into your uh, death trap. So let's have a look at the recipes now. They're very simple. So for the dummy head, you just need uh, one brown wool, one lapis, um, and if you if you can't find any cocoa beans, which won't be a problem in the next 1.3 version of Minecraft because they'll grow in the woods, in the, sorry, in the rainforests, but you can just mix colours to get brown, and that will give you a dummy head, and of course to make a dummy, you just need to put two wooden blocks down. Igniter, Again, as you'd expect, it's just surrounded by cobblestone, redstone in the middle, nether rack at the top. A bear trap is a pressure plate surrounded by iron, that'll give you two bear traps. The spikes is just iron, shaped like an upside down T, that'll give you four spikes. Uh, the grass covers, you need three pieces of grass and three sticks, and that'll give you three grass coverings. So that's, that's probably my favourite one out of this, the gra grass coverings. Um, a fan, very simple, uh, you just surround a, a, an iron ingot with cobble, and then the magnetic chest, which is going to be another good one, uh, is is basically this, so you surround iron with wood and wood red, redstone at the bottom. So there we are, that is all there is to this mod, um, but you can do some really inventive stuff with it, as you can imagine, with a setup of fans and bear traps and holes and, and all sorts of stuff. Oh yeah, Unsuspect unsuspecting people would be getting killed left, right and centre. So there we go, I hope you enjoyed that. Very short, quick look at this uh, mod. I hope you enjoyed, so don't forget to like and favourite.